This is a demonstration of my work, work in progress locomotion system. The locomotion system automatically blends keyframed or motion captured walk and run cycles and then adjusts the movements of the bones in the legs to ensure that the feet step correctly on the ground. The system can adjust animations made for specific speed and direction on a plane surface to any speed any direction and any curvature on any surface, including arbitrary steps and slopes. In this demonstration, a character with nine animations is used. There are animations for walking forward, walking right, walking left and walking backwards and there are run cycles for running forward running right running left and running backwards the locomotion system automatically interpolates between these one and run these walk and run cycles to obtain walking and running with any speed and direction. The velocity can be changed arbitrarily at any point in time, even during steps. The locomotion system does not enforce any high-level control scheme, but rather lets the character be moved around by any means desired. The locomotion system silently observes the position, alignment, velocity and rotational velocity of the character and it uses everything from that along with some raycasts onto the ground. Using the blended animation as a basis, the locomotion system uses inverse kinematics to adjust the animations to surfaces of any slope. For comparison, a character is shown in the background that does not use inverse kinematics to adjust the leg movements. Using the inverse kinematics, the character can walk uphill, downhill, sideways along a slope, and in any other direction. The inverse kinematics are also used to let the character walk up and down steps. The character can walk down steps. And up steps. Notice how the character anticipates steps in advance and lifts up the feet high enough to accommodate them. The character can walk up and down steps of any height.
The character can also walk on arbitrary surfaces, combining any variations of steps and slopes. As previously mentioned, the character uses 9 animations to interpolate between. However, the locomotion system also works with fewer animations. This identical model uses only 3 animations. Idle, as shown now, walking forward, and running forward. From only these three animations, the system can still generate movements in other directions, although it doesn't look as good. However, the ability for the system, just a moment, the ability for the locomotion system to work with only two or three animations make it suitable even for studios with limited budgets for animation asset creation, particularly if the game doesn't require the character to walk backwards or sideways. The locomotion system works for almost any character and preserves the style of the motion inherent in the animations used. For example, we have also tested the system with a bird model. This demonstration was presented by Rune Skobo Johansen. More information is available at runevision.com slash blog.